let's get this cursed fucking stream off the ground, and we'll see where we end up. I may just start playing video games here in a second. Just know that. This is uh, for the couple of people here that are here. Yeah. No offense, but I don't stream for these low of numbers. Um, yeah, we may just call this. Oh. I was going to sleep through fucking today. I was I was going to sleep through the stream and just like do a bad movie night on Discord. Um so mm, where's the volume? There's the volume. I was just going to do some dying light. I was just going to do some dying light. Hey ask. Um ugh. get some of my protein shake. Um why is that not doing a thingy? There we go. Uh, it's got co-op. <clears throat> Dying Light has co-op. Um, and... You can get it on Steam sale right now. That's, that's, uh, hey Jack, that's where I got it, Karina. Is, I, I got it on sale for like, I got everything. Um, I got like the Dying Light extended fucking magic edition with like all DLC and shit like that. Um, for not that much. The base game is, a is 12 bucks right now. But Dying Light, um, yeah, yeah, view page, just, just god damn it, Steam. Um, the Platinum Edition with everything is 15 bucks, 14.99. Yeah, like, yeah, season pass, fucking all the DLC, all that sort of shit is 15 bucks. So, it's a pretty good deal, actually. Um, if you use a VPN to Argentina, it's much cheaper. I look, I don't mind paying 15 bucks for a game. Um, uh, for Toos, uh, occasionally I, I like, uh, mobility games, like games that I can run in parkour. Um, and, um, I don't mind bashing a zombie's head in from time to time, but, um, it's a, it's a different kind of, um, stealth. It's a different kind of stealth. It's it's a sort of like nighttime. Holy shit! Run 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 stealth, right? Um, but yeah, uh, Karina. Either way, you'd have to you have to play the tutorial and then you have to sleep through the first night, and then you the the following morning. Um, you uh, will see a pop up explaining that you can now play multiplayer. Um, so, yeah. Um, I didn't, look, I like the idea of Mirror's Edge, Beast. I played it. Um, I, I, I liked the idea of Mirror's Edge. I, I didn't like Mirror's Edge. Um, I really wanted to like it, though. I really wanted to like it. Um, no. No, Rev, I have not. Hey, Viscus. Um, yeah, I, 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 ask, ask, sing. Same. I rarely finish a game. Honestly, like, uh, the amount of games I've finished, like, properly, it's not a huge list. Um, let's see. I mean, fighting games don't count, right? I've finished all the Mortal Kombat's back in the day, but fighting games don't count. Like, um, Fable, Fable 2, Halo, Half-Life. Um, 
New Vegas. Hitman franchise. Just Hitman franchise. I finish Hitman. Um... What else? Dishonored. Uh, Dishonored, I finished. Um, oh, um, Kingdom Hearts, the first one. Kingdom Hearts, the first one. Um, Jack, I, 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 I tried Kingdoms of, uh, Kingdoms of Amalur. I tried it. Hey, radio. Um, Yeah, I like uh, I like Kingdom Hearts. I I, I like it. Um, I, I it's it's obnoxious. Um, I I wish Kingdom Hearts were written in a way that made it intelligible. Um, Kingdom Hearts nineteen point two slash stroke ultra uh, ultras revenge edge point nine revision fourteen can go fuck itself though right like all that weirdo kingdom Hearts shit is just obnoxious like they can go fuck themselves with that um but uh, it's a good series it's a good series i enjoyed i enjoyed it i played one and two i played one and two um never i haven't gotten around to three yeah exactly jack like fuck that right like kingdom hearts is just it's a convoluted mess. It's a nightmare of a story. Um, nice. Yeah. Nice. Karina. Good. Congratulations on that. I saw that. Less Disney and less a story that reads like a royal family tree. Uh, <laughs> Rev. Um, it's, I mean, okay, so it's not a JRPG, though, uh, Viscous. Like, that's that's where I come in the fray, right? Like, because Kingdom Hearts isn't a JRPG. It has a lot of the aesthetics. It has a lot of the storytelling mechanics of a JRPG, but it isn't a JRPG as far as, like, the game mechanics go. And that makes it playable by me because I hate JRPGs. Um, They're just, I'm sorry. Like, they're fucking obnoxious. Let me, let me fight. Why can't I get... I can get two hits in here. Why is my character relegated to one hit? I know he could get a fucking second hit in here. I could do this. I could d get in there, darsh, uh, d uh, dash in, fucking hit and block and back out, right? Like, why am I relegated to one hit per turn? This is a stupid mechanic. Who fights like this? Oh, hold on. I'm just going to stand here and let you get a hit in now. Fucking, it's stupid. I hate the JRPG fight system. It's a stupid mechanic, and it needs to die. It needs to die. It's a horrible fight mechanic. I don't give a shit about your abstraction, for two. Your abstraction is inaccurate, and it's stupid. It needs to die. I hate JRPG fights. A Japanese role-playing game-esque. Uh, turn base is almost always cringe. Fallout one and two was okay though. Hey, Fallout one, and two. yeah, they're okay, but it, yeah, it's turn base sucks. It fucking sucks. <laughs> it's it's rock paper scissors. Yeah, why is this a three person match? I've got seven people just watching in the party. Yes, it sucks outright. Um, yeah, uh, um, yeah, I I absolutely it's it's rock paper scissors. That's all it is. What's up, Ancom? Um, yeah, I, I have absolutely no tolerance for the JRPG fight mechanic. Card-based, turn-based, fuck all that shit. All that shit is just obnoxious. What's up, Index? Um, yeah, I hate him. Try and cancel me for it. Fuck you. Um, I thought you were based, guy. Yeah, no. Um... I like JRPGs, and this shit's bugged me since before puberty is beast. Uh, turn based only works for highly strategic games that include movement. If there's no movement turn based, it's garbo and unnecessary. Uh, I don't hate deck building combat games. That's why Zelda 2 Adventures of Link is superior. I never got into the Zelda games. Um, XCOM. XCOM with its fucking horrible, horrible role system can go fuck itself, right? Like XCOM on its horrible role system can just go fuck itself. I am, I am so sick of fucking, um, of getting like just, it's part of the charm. It's part of the nightmare 
I uh, look, look, I get it. I get it. There's a statistical chance that like with a 99% shot accuracy, I could, my guy could miss. Fuck you. Fuck you. I don't, one, I don't believe half those rolls. I think that game fudges its rolls. I can't prove it. I don't even want to look into proving it. I think XCOM fudges its rolls. Um, I, I, I don't, I don't trust that game's math. I don't trust that game's math. That seems like when it's a clutch shot, fucking 99% accuracy. Miss. 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 Like, mmm. XCOM. Mmm. XCOM. I want to like XCOM. I want to like XCOM. I want to like XCOM. I can't fucking like XCOM. I've tried. I've given it so many tries. Um... Side scrolling platform with Metrovania and RPG elements and overworld like uh, OGFF or Chrono Trigger. Oh, interesting. Yeah, that is interesting, Raph. It, so they do fudge rolls. Fucking knew it. Never even looked into it. Never even looked into it. I fucking. I had that suspicion for ages with XCOM. Fucking A. Yeah, of course. Zelda 2 is a massive black sheep. Interesting. Um, yeah. Oh, let's see. Um, Radical. Second Oxford English Dictionary definition. Fundamental or systemic change, especially that within a political system. Fundamental or systemic change, especially that within a political system. Look around. Is it all good? Is it working for you? Is it working the way you would, you would design the system? Or does it need a complete or massive overhaul at a fundamental level? Yes? Congratulations. You too are already a radical. Anyway. Um, play a game long enough you can tell the uh, computer cheats. Yeah, oh yeah, I, dude, I, um, I absolutely, uh, it, f it, homie, really, really, you, re oh my god, I can't. It's Friday. I'm not gonna fucking argue with somebody who doesn't even look. Go take an econ class or something while you're at it. Anyway, um. Let's see. <clears throat> so, um, what was I talking? Who was I talking to? It was I put too many JRPGs and turn-based strategies and grand strategy. I, you know, uh, it's okay. Um, I feel sad when I play League of Legends. Um, then I feel angry, so it works. Nice, Jack. Um, do you know most people in the U.S. can't afford a four hundred dollar emergency? It works perfectly, right? Yep. Yeah. Um. If there's no cover in your way, the roll is exactly how it displays. But if you have multiple cover, it will randomly detract from your roll. Int Wait. If there's no cover, the roll is exactly how it displays. Okay. So, literally my attempt at, like, using cover strategies in um, XCOM was what's screwing me, Karina. Fascinating. Um. Okay. Um, oh, and we should take a moment. We should take a moment. We should take a moment. A real fucking OG past, right? Like, dicks out for fucking Betty White, right? The way she would have, she would have liked it. Oh, uh, so Lauren Southern, Infrared, um, Xander Hall. Oh, Hans of, uh, Harkir. Oh, okay, cool. Got it. Thanks. Um, Yeah, like, fucking Betty White was an OG. She was funny. Her timing was brilliant. She was fucking... Dude, she was there at, like, the outset of a lot of stuff. Man, she saw some shit. She did some shit. She lived a fucking life and a half. Like, solid dicks out for fucking Betty White. 
a real a real baller of an OG. Yeah. That's I'm 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 do 2022 is going to be a nightmare, right? Like when even Betty White when the immortals start tapping, right? Like that's that's what you're looking at is like an immortal was like, "You know what? I would rather not be here anymore." <laughs> I'm worried about 2022. <laughs> Betty White tapped. Holy shit. Uh, unless you have a sniper cover detracts from to hit rolls, and so sniper melee teams are the meta. Oh, interesting. Um, oh, so we, um, we were looking at some of the photography last night of what was happening last night. Um, in Boulder County. Um, so this is, this is the results. Climate change. Uh, grass fires, grass fires from downed electrical lines due to wind storms, Jay. Interesting, Karina. So it does it does play like somewhat fair on that. It's screwing everybody. <laughs> yeah. Oh, um, five LAPD killings in nine days. Five in nine days. How is that never... I know, right? It's almost like they're a gang or something. Um, yeah, they are. Fifty-five percent of the time, like that's that's what that works out. Five five divided by nine. You're you're looking at about fifty-five percent of the time, right? Like, um, so over half now, over half of the time, uh, LAPD is just busy like summarily execute executing civilians at this point. Yay. Um, also, what is this company's name? Hold on. I want to name check this piece of shit company that needs to just, <clears throat> um, library systems and services, library systems and services. This is a for-profit company that is right now, as we speak, trying to privatize as many public libraries as they possibly can. Library systems and services. So they're going around and cutting deals with like small municipalities and townships and counties and even some larger cities and saying like, hey, we can operate your libraries for cheaper um, if you turn them over to us and we'll get that line item off your books. That's a cost for you now and we'll turn it into a profit source for you. So, yeah. So, yay. Um, um, uh, yeah. And in 20 years, they're, they'll all, uh, they'll be all for subsidies. Um, oh, y'all know DeSantis is missing, right? The governor of Florida? He's missing. This motherfucker ain't been seen. Like, the suspicion is he's got COVID. Yeah. The motherfucker went missing. 
He's the his his social media team is even trying to fake his existence. Not kidding. They've been posting videos. Hey, Dig. <clears throat> Thank you for the resub, Dig. Ooh, Prime Bucks, Daddy Bezos, but am I? Um, they've been posting videos and photos of him supposedly at places that were recorded earlier. That, like, they posted today a video of him at like a football game that was three months old. Um, like a couple of days ago, they posted him at a bagel shop from a while back as well. They're, they're literally trying to fake like he he's he's out in the public eye. He's not. This motherfucker went missing. Like DeSantis literally is like hole up in a fucking hospital bed somewhere. Something like nobody knows for sure. He's just. But yeah, most people are speculating that he's got COVID and he's hiding. Jesus for two, yeah. So, it'd be great. Oh, Cupcake, if he dies of COVID, I'm laughing my ass off. I'm laughing my ass off. Yeah. Yeah, if, if Ron DeSantis dies of COVID, I am so there for it. Like, fuck that. Like, oh, you shouldn't laugh. No, I'm laughing at that motherfucker. Yeah, Cassidy, that's that's the more likely. Because he's getting the best health care treatment possible. Like, he's down, he's getting fucking antibody treatments. He's getting, like, the monoclonal antibody treatments and all God knows what else, right? Like... Omicron death sentence, yeah. What am I most afraid of? I gotta tell you, at this point in my life, <laughs> I live in pain 24 hours a day, seven days a week. Yeah, right. Like, Cassidy, like, not much, right? Like, there's, after you live with, like, progressive illnesses and you, you live in pain constantly, there's not much that really, like... <laughs> I have no children. I don't give a shit about this world. Like, I look, yeah, I, good luck. I wish you the best. Um, fuck it. Thanks for the subject. Um, I, 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 I wish every, I wish humanity the best. But I mean, honestly, there's not much. I mean, one of the things that springs to mind is like Beast reminded me, like Beast said, a female stalker. Uh, like my stalker ex suddenly reappeared. Dude, after a bunch of years gone and all of a sudden he's back posting weird shit on my door. Dude, that'd be a nightmare. But beyond that, um, the federal government trying to make my life a miser uh, like more of a m miserable hellhole that it already is. That's always a nightmare. But I'd probably pull an Aaron Schwartz, to be perfectly honest. Um, so. Oh, I know about that one. The Chimera Squad one. I saw somebody's playthrough. Was that Christopher Odd? I think it was Christopher Odd. Um. God, I'm tired. Dude, I'm, I'm, I'm like two, three hours short sleep today. I, I didn't get to sleep until the, like, mid-morning, early afternoon sort of situation. Oh, God. Mm. What is this? This is fireworks. Oh, it's like drones and shit. Hmm. Um. Happy New Year to you as well, non binary. Um.
Uh, Ancom, I'm sorry. Fucking tankies are always yelling about how we should be gulagged and our mother should have been, like, the rape of our mother should have been aborted. As in us. Sorry. Like, we've got... We've probably got a few hundred messages between the community at this point from tankies telling us that we should have been aborted, our mothers should have been raped, um, that we should all be gulagged. Like, sorry. There's no love lost at this point. Fucking tankies can go fuck themselves. <laughs> Just the way it is. I've, I've, none of my people fucking, <clears throat> no anarchists, fucking, de definitely not me, has ever walked into a tanky space on this platform and started screaming, all of them should be, like, put to death. Right? They do it all the time. They do it all the time. So, <laughs> fuck them. I, I, I don't, I don't, you know, yeah. They do, Che. They do get real weird when you're like, yeah, I should have been aborted. Has has really gone off the fascist deep end of late. I mean, it's because Has is fucking batshit insane to start with. I've met one reasonable tanky. One. And he's European. He's a classical tanky. Like, he's an actual fucking real tanky. Right? Like, he's, he's not like... Yeah. I've met one. The rest of them are dumb, deluded, angry, or violent, or some combination therein. Ah. <sighs> uh. Uh, what's a real tanky? A uh, member of the CPGB um, or the CPSU. What's up, cow? <laughs> yeah. Um. So there you go. Like, and that's like, like classic. Like that's a real fucking tanky. Um. So. I, I just don't want to, I don't, non-binary, I just don't care. That's, to be perfect honest, I looked at the video, I just don't. Slow oars through the clouds, and every old hello. I don't care. I, I don't, I don't give a shit about some fucking heartfelt bullshit fucking, like, I, I'm, honestly, like, oh, let's feel wistful about the, ugh, God, it's a nightmare hellscape. And we're all having to suffer through it. Hope should be sacrificed on the altar of pragmatism at this point. Yeah, I said it. <laughs> uh. Fair enough, Fiscus. Fair enough, my man. Spite is much better. Spite is much better, Rev. Spite is a much better reason to live. Hope is fucking stupid. Spite, on the other hand, that'll get the job done. Okay, radio. Sp hope is temporary. Spite is eternal. If doom has taught us anything, it is that hope, that spite is eternal. Yes. Too angry to die. Dude, that's a real thing. Being too angry to die is a real thing. 
dude, there's plenty of instances of that in combat. <laughs> historically contemporarily like there there's there's plenty of examples of that people just too angry to die like literally like 27 rounds in their torso limbs blown off and they're still chucking grenades with their other arm like they don't dude spite and anger are a hell of a thing dude they can keep you going they can keep you going yeah Preach, Marcus. At this point, I'm more of I'm less of a man and more of an amalgamation of barely contained anger and wild turkey. Just yeah, just live in a perpetual state of rage to achieve immortality. <laughs> uh Orc has run me ragged, running on rum and coke, some jelly. I'm ready to fight God or become him. I, you know. Kill God, then you become him. Fuck yeah, Doomer. Like spite, uh, spite with some adrenaline, so I'm gonna have a real bad day. Um, just like Santa. <laughs> just like Santa. Um, let's see, how do I actually do this? Four player co-op. Dying Light actually supports four player co-op. I didn't know that. I figured it was like two people. Sessions in co-op can be started by going into matchmaking with other players. You can also invite your friends directly from the friends list for a session. Um, I really wish somebody just show me the screens. Uh, um, Karina, I have the music turned off on Dying Light. It's, dude, it's shit. Honestly, it's it's not that it's shit. It's that it's got a lot of irritating ambient like sounds to it. Like I I get like having screamers in the background and weird like, but the the music track, uh, the music for Dying Light adds in extra noise to the like ambient soundtrack. Oh, the Doom. Um, I don't. I'm pretty sure the Doom soundtrack is playable without a DMCA strike. Um, I think. Um, I don't know for certain though. Also, I'm gonna look at this. Give me a sec. I'm gonna, I'm gonna open Dying Light here. <laughs> I want to see the the co-op. I want to see how the fuck I do this. Skip, 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 skip. Nobody cares. Skip. Um, publisher intro videos and like. Game development studio intro videos should be illegal. Just saying. Um, let's see. Online game type. Public, private. Allow human co-ops. Voice chat. There's zombie invasion. All right. Vehicle sharing. Okay, cool. Um, so if I set it to that, to private. And then continue without events. Let me see it. See what it looks like. Um, hey, Klepto. Oh, God, I can already hear the fucking fireworks. Hey, Saul's Visser. Hey, Saul Visser. Jesus Christ. Um, am I really going to need to buy it on Steam? Uh, Jack, I mean, I can, it's where you should. Uh, I mean, I don't think it's on, I don't know if it's on uh, good old games. If anything, you should buy it on good old games. Um, but, oh, well then, I, I don't know 
how it's cross compatible on that, I don't know. Um, options. Why is my video like not full screen? Yes. There we go. Like, why is it not full screen? Um, Uh, matchmaking, nope, to, oh, invite players right down there, dummy. Okay, cool, cool, cool. All right. Got it. Now I know how to work it. I just know how to work it now, baby. Uh, no, Beast, I wasn't streaming it. I wasn't putting it on the screen yet. I was just looking at it. Um, yeah, Cat, for sure. I just want to see, it, like, yeah. I just wanted to try it out and see what it looked like. But, I mean, even Karina's got, like, the tutorial takes about 45 minutes to complete. Um, and then, uh, you have to get your safe location and sleep and then you can play co-op in Dying Light. So, yeah. Uh. uh, 15 bucks, all DLC season pass, everything included, Cat, on Steam right now. It's part of the Steam sale. Yeah. So, like, Dying Light plus a list of DLC like that. $14.99. I don't know, Jack. Um... Oh, Beast, that's a fucking nightmare. That's a nightmare beast. Uh, yes, apparently you can, um, Jack. So you know, I there's instructions on how to do it on the Steam page, uh, Steam community pages, uh, link in chat, uh, Jack. Um, so there you go. It is apparently doable. <sighs> eh, because it doesn't matter, Karina. It doesn't matter. <laughs> you you get like, dude. If you bought the DLC pack, you got plenty of fucking customization then, um, or at least outfit customization. Dude, Crane is like, there's a cane. Uh, there's there's Crane. Like he's he's the character, right? Like you don't get to customize Aloy in um, Horizon Zero Dawn, right? Like you get to change the outfit. Like there's the protagonist, and that's it. I'm okay with that. Yeah, Crane's just a vehicle for your shit. Like, I honestly, I'm okay with it. I, I, I'm, I'm in the camp of either give me tons of options or give me no options. Like, I don't mind. I just hate like a gender option, right? Like, oh, you get generic man, generic woman. That's boring as fuck, right? And that means you have to like kill the story usually to make that work because they don't put in the work to actually shift everything for a, a multi-gendered sort of thing what they just do is like genericize the entire story which is just shit so like either stick with a single protagonist or like go full whole hog on it but yeah yeah oh yeah fucking crane is neutral mask he's like keanu reeves He's, he's just a kid. He's a blank slate for you to project yourself onto. That's all. Yeah. Cool. Okay. Um, oops. There we go. Wrong one. Um... I don't even know what the uh, the co-op looks like on it. Don't try it. Karina and I might get get to it tonight. Um, but we'll see.
Oh, yeah, I still didn't. I couldn't show that on stream. I can't. Still can't. Um, that's fair. I, there's room for hyper customization, weather. There's room for hyper customization, but I would much prefer a singular protagonist per perspective. Write the story the way it needs written, right? Like if you're going to tell a story, tell a story. Um, like if you want like multiple, like if you want variants of character, tell a Rashomon. Um, it's uh, sorry. Like, I'm just going to shorthand this shit. If you don't know what Rashomon is, that's on you. Um, but if you're, if you're looking for like multiple perspectives, tell a story, like, you know, do pull a Rashomon and tell it from multiple perspectives. But like, I, I, you know what I think of when I think of like that basic, like, oh, you get to be a man or a woman, um, was, um, oh fuck. It just slipped. <laughs> Oh, I don't even fucking there's the um oh um Assassin's Creed Origins or Odyssey. Odyssey. It's Odyssey. Um it's Odyssey that is the problem. Um that's just boring. It's just boring no matter who you're playing with. It's Odyssey, yeah. Dude. Some. Yes, Karina, some. But the story was just... Ugh. It was bad. I'm also reminded of... Um, what's the other Assassin's Creed where they did the brother and sister? The, the, the fucking um, Industrial uh, Revolution England. Oh, uh, what was that? Hello. Syndicate. Yes, it was Syndicate. Thank you. Um... Best Assassin's Creed game as far as mechanics and engine go. Worst Assassin's Creed game as far as story, character, plot, execution. Like, yeah. Like, it, it, I wish most... I wish all the Assassin's Creed games used the Syndicate engine. I, I enjoyed the fuck out of playing that one. But their story was... Shit... Huh, interesting, Karina. No, that was that was basically the first that was basically it, Patronum. Um Yeah, Rev, like if they just if they just rebranded the games, I'd be happier with it. If they just stopped calling them Assassin's Creed games, I, I would have less problem with them. For sure. Dude, Jack, I never got Unity to work. Never. Never. I tried it a couple of years ago, even. Still couldn't get it to work. It crashed something like 64 times in the first 10 minutes. Honestly, it... it yeah, it was bad. It was bad. I could never get it. Hey, Fotech. Um, I could never get it to fucking work correctly. <laughs> Prey seeking arrows are historically accurate. Yeah, cat, fucking, dude, Assassin's Creed, dude, the Assassin's Creed ends with the Ezio trilogy. Fucking fight me. Look, I like Black Flag as much as the next person. I fucking like, you know, I, I but it, it, Assassin's Creed is over after Ezio. You either die a hero or live long enough to see Assassin's Creed become a Sims game. Um... Black Flag was great. It's it's probably the best pirate game in existence. Black Flag is probably the best pirate game in existence. It's just not a very good Assassin's Creed game, that's all. Yeah. It's a great game. It's just not 
Assassin's Creed, that's all. Uh, you finally got Forza, uh, Forza Horizons 5 working on your desktop and holy shit. Dude, Rev, Forza is, Forza Horizons is great. It's great. I'll see what's a Greek power fantasy. You'll say here's my fantasy. If you're here, if you're good monitors, find the real imagine. It's like how Fallout 4 is an amazing open world game, an amazing immersive world, doesn't make its story good. Odyssey is an amazing concept and soundtrack, just a shite game. I, I, you know, yeah. All right, fair enough. Um, The Pirates of the Caribbean MMO. Wither, I wish I could I wish I could enjoy Disco Elysium. Um, Disco Elysium is an ama is an amazing game that uses a mechanic or an engine system or a style of gameplay that I find irritating as fuck. Uh, point and click isometric. I do not enjoy. I do I do not enjoy. I, 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 I quite hate playing point and click isometrics. Um, Jack, I'm in that same camp. I wish I could enjoy Disco Elysium. The writing is amazing. I've seen like playthroughs and stuff like that. Um, the writing is amazing. The character detail is amazing. The world building is amazing. I, I, it, it's, it's nothing against like Disco Elysium. Disco Elysium is an amazing game. That is a game style that I really do not, I don't vibe with, and I've never been able to enjoy. Not, not to the fullest extent that I should. So, yeah, that's, that's just sort of how I feel on that one. Ah. Uh. Yeah, exactly, Jack. It's, 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 it's objectively a very good game. It's just not my type of game. That's all. Uh, <laughs> if my politics reflected my fetishes, we'd all be having a great time. Oh, I don't know what my, what would be the political reflection of my fetishes? I, mean, I wouldn't want to. I wouldn't want to reflect my fetishes as, as um, 16 hours old, they're doing a ban evasion, homosexual masochism. The fact that they even know that means this motherfucker got banned from this channel. So, yeah. Yeah, most assuredly doing a ban evasion. Um, Karina, what's your uh, dying light installation look like? <laughs> Politicized consensual self enslavement. I, you know, yeah, like I, the last thing I would want is my fetishes to be basis of. Uh, oh, I don't have a skirt on. Ask. I'll re I'll kick your points back, but I don't have a skirt on right now. Um, okay, you're doing the tutorial. Cool, cool, cool. I'll give you your points back, though. I'll give everybody their points back for the last few days. Because why not? Um, reward queue. Because why not? Reject all. Refund. Refund. Cat, I'm lucky I'm clothed. I basically just rolled out of the bathtub onto stream. Buddhist just got a fucking rebate and a half. Um... Oh, I'm wearing sh uh, shorts right now, Beast. I'm just fucking lazy. Yeah. 
Ugh, underwear only streams as a VTuber. Well, I mean, it's not like I'm wearing much underneath. No. <laughs> it's like, actually, I'm not wearing it. Um, that's how that's how I'm going to go out. Um, that, that'll be my last stream on Twitch. It's just fucking like rock out with the cock out sort of thing and then throw it to a side view. Uh, no, I've never considered ch uh, yoga pants. <laughs> <laughs> well, boys, we're moving to Chatterbait. Uh, or Omegle. Chatterbait, Omegle. Um, we could probably do it on DLive, too. Does Amaranth really make $1.5 a month, Patronum? Jesus Christ. Bruh. Good honor. Yeah, I'm surprised. Dude, the fact that people will pay for that still... Yeah. Wow. Oof. Yeah, no. Credit where credit's due. Who's the, who's the, who's the chick that did... Uh, Belle Delphine, right? The chick that did the gamer, gamer water? Uh, gamer girl bathwater. Yeah, dude, I, I, I have nothing but respect for these fuckers working it. I, I, I got nothing but love for it, right? Like it just, yeah, it fucking shocks me that dudes are that horny and hard up for it. I, I just, yeah, like I total respect. I, I just, it always shocks me that motherfuckers are that desperate. That they like. I. I don't get it. Just, just go look at some porn. Just like go watch some fucking porn and rub one out. Yeah, exactly, Rev. If you're that desperate, porn exists. Like I don't get it. Kai gamer water when no. Uh, no, just no. <laughs> you can even order custom made porn, is a thing I have heard. Um. Kai workout sweat. Oh, Jesus. Uh, it's free. It's so easy to find. You'll get pop-ups when you're not even looking for it. Hey, Aka. I, would just, I just learned that uh, Amaranth made $1.5 a month. And I was we were just sort of talking about the fact that, like, people are so hard up for it that, like, they're paying Amaranth. I, I don't, like, I just don't get it. Like, I just don't get it. Like, just go, like, go to YouPorn or Pornhub or XNXX and fucking rub one out like a goddamn man. <laughs> like, I, I don't, just take your fucking pick. Like, I don't give a shit where you, where you find your titties and vagina. Like, just, I don't. It kind of is, though, Fotech, because it's. Um, oh God, are we, yep, fucking done. Um, Amaranth, titties, titties.
That's Amaranth. So I look, I nothing against her. Nothing against her personally. She needs to get get yours get yours, girl. Ain't ain't nothing but respect and love from my side for her. Right? My 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 criticism is for the people paying her. That that's the part that I find a little weird. Yeah, yeah, she good on her. She fucking gets it. Patrona, apparently she said she didn't have long energy looks, etc. to capitalize on it. So she is. Yeah, I too am a fan of manipulating the straight, says Kat. Yeah, right? Like, I... A fucking Aspen. Um, <laughs> I swear to God, if I find any of you motherfuckers have rubbed one out to me. Um, which is not an invitation to tell me or or otherwise. Um, yeah, no, like, I, I credit where credit's due. Girl, go get it. But, like, dude, if I were 18 and Twinkie and all, like, cute and shit again, um, and I came of age in the OnlyFans era, oh, you better believe I'd just go find a fucking boyfriend, and we would be fucking every day, multiple times a day, and filming that shit, and theming it, and fucking releasing it. Like, yeah, fucking get some cash, and then we'd do a game stream, and fucking, oh, yeah, you better believe it'd be titillating. Like, fucking, well, Viva, if you rub one out to me, I want to know about it. Um... <laughs> Big, hairy, sweaty German dude rubbing one out to me. I need to know. Um, Bungo Taigo. Oh, well, it doesn't count as a VTuber. VTubers aren't people. He's the ultimate femboy. Yeah, no. Um, <laughs> God, Karina. Uh, uh. <laughs> Good to know, Viva. Uh. I mean, Burger, you can rub one to Burger. You can rub one out to anything. <laughs> uh. Exactly, Jack. Exactly. Where there's a will. I've had more shameful faps, to be honest. Um, I'm just trying to think of my most shameful fap. Here's, 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 here's the, here's the issue. Um, I don't have any shame. There's no shame in my game. Dude, I've rubbed shit out to uncomfortable stuff, perverted stuff, weird stuff. Like, I don't like, exactly, like, there's no shame in my game. So it's like, at this point, like, I don't even have the refractory, like, oh, God, what did I just do? Like, post-masturbation thing. Like, I don't know, whatever. Whatever it takes to get the job done, right? Wherever you gotta go, we all got dark places. Sometimes you're spiraling down, like, you know, the, and you just need that dopamine hit. You gotta go the really fucked up, weird fucking shame like shameful horrible place in your head to get the job done fucking go there do that who gives a shit fucking it's your own brain yeah like i'm way past that exactly aspen for two i don't appreciate being called out that way <laughs> um yeah Uh, what's that fucking rev? What's that joke? Uh, I've seen har I've seen things horrible things at poor fish, right? Did you know? Um, fucking, did you know chickens? Um, uh, did you know chickens die after having sex? It's true. I mean, I fucked that chicken and it died right after. 
shame and fear is a social context. It's one of our biggest limiters on sound choice. Fair enough. Let's see. Yeah, and you can you can substitute like um, just about any um, any animal that's inappropriate, small inappropriate animals, like Chihuahua. Did you know Chihuahuas die after they have sex? No, it's true. There you go. Oh, if you have post nut shame on vanilla porn, I I pity you. Just as a human being, I pity you. Uh, why are orphans so bad at baseball? That can that can never be home. Uh, they can never find home. Dax just walked in on the um, uh, on the like the the joke apparently. Yes. Ooh, guinea pigs. Yes, exactly. Guinea. Did you know guinea pigs die after they have sex? I mean, it certainly died after I fucked it. Um. Uh, <laughs> Mark has decided this chat uh, this chat has made me come around to the idea of kink shaming I now enthusiastically endorse it um <laughs> it's premarital and older when you need them uh, <laughs> Fair enough, Aspen. Um, I got public loser. I clipped public a couple of streams ago, a few streams ago, and they were doing a sarcastic. It was for Buddhist, actually. Um, I got a good clip of public. It was great. Yeah, uh, they were doing. Uh, public was doing a sarcastic um, like rant about how. Um, Black people need to thank white people for ending racism for by voting for Obama, and oh he, fuck, public they um public fucking um, they 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 leaned into it. Public leaned into it. It was great. But public even like put some stank on the and black people, right? Like it was, yeah. And uh, yeah, it was, and the blacks, right? Like it was like that. Oh, it was, it was a good fucking, and I trimmed it just so there was no context whatsoever. There was none. It was just this fucking rant from public about how the black, the blacks need to fucking, it was great. It's like, and there we go. Uh, oh, poor public. I like getting clips of public that are completely inappropriate. Uh, I mean, K would probably do it, Rev. They, they, Buddhist and Cricks, they. I know I've occasionally fuck it too, but it's pronoun is they them, yeah. Um, all right. Um, that one is, yes. oh, for, okay. You know what? First off. Uh, there we go. <laughs> okay. Drag up there. There we go. Now I can do it. Yes, there we go. Um, so where's Karina? Karina's there. All right, cool. I'll be able to just throw you an invite, Karina. Where am I? What am I doing? Oh, I just need a car battery? Check battery. All right, 
you're gonna be a pain in my ass. I'm gonna come, I'm gonna come fucking hit you. How, how did you track me on that? That was bullshit. All right. Um. Let me get to the battery on this thing. It's on the side somewhere, isn't it? Alright, you idiots, follow me. Come here. Try to come up here. Everybody following me? Cool. Cool. Done and done. Your battery, Kurt. Okay, so we've got the casing. Next, I'll need some metal scrap from the junkyard to use for shrapnel. After that, I need sugar and some cables. Jesus Christ, just give me a fucking list, man. Get the bomb that'll blast a hundred infected at once. All right, fuck this. Um, oh, this cam. Bam. There we go. Um. Oh. A beast left side at the end usually. Thank you, beast. Uh. <laughs> Good night, Ask. Sleep well. How's your tutorial going, Karina? Fuck. I played a game online in 2009. Didn't like it. <laughs> oh, Doomer, yeah. That was an interesting um, book choice, though, for age 13, for sure. You were, a, you were a bit of a precocious reader, weren't you, Doomer? That's, uh, that's quite the fucking book to... At f thirteen, heretic in chat. Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2. Rev. Um, I've never played the Call of Duty series. It's never been it's never attracted me. I played um I played one of the battlefields. I forget which one. Maybe the OG. It may be battle like the first one. I don't fucking know though. I don't remember. Um but yeah, I I didn't mm. Not my thing. Yeah, yeah, I think it's Call of Duty that does the zombies. Local PvP with high school friends. Absolutely did not enjoy online. Yeah. Oh, yeah, that's not a fairly... That's not a regular occurrence, Karina, so don't worry about it. I was worried if that mechanic was going to crop up, like, all the time. Whether it was going to be a thing. Um, but like, I think I'm like a quarter, maybe 30% of the way through. I haven't had another seizure. So yeah.
just trying to think when the end of the, the fucking tutorial is for Dying Light. Ugh. I think it's when you go down to the no yeah i think it's when you go down to the 19th floor nope that's that's the roof training building okay so it's when you get to enter the slums for the first time outside the tower got it um Whatever, Karina. Whatever. No worries. Honestly, like, I'm, I'm ready to pull the plug on this fucking stream and just, like, we could go over to voice chat right now. <laughs> if you guys want to hang out in voice chat and just call this fucking stream, like, I, I'd, be, I'd be fine with that. <laughs> I don't feel like doing politics tonight. I'm not going to do fucking analysis or news or whatever else. Um, so... It's up to us as a community to just, like, move on over to Discord when we want. Um, here's, a, here's a hot take for you. Um, I like Borderlands better than Borderlands 2. Borderlands, for me, for me, personal preference, I like Borderlands better than Borderlands 2. I, I know it's not always the the prevailing opinion, but nice to see Beast agrees with me. Uh, I've never even bothered bothered playing Borderlands Three because I'm done with the series. Cat, they lost me. TK Baja had me fucked up. Uh, yeah, you mean Hunter Tom Hunter S. Thompson? Yeah, Aka, we'll we'll do we'll do BMN tonight. Um, oh. Yeah, I, I like I like a, I like a good nod to Hunter Thompson. Hunt, Hunter is and any any reference to Hunter works for me, but. All right. I say we just, what time is it? It's seven o'clock. Fuck it. Fuck it. Hour and a half stream. Low numbers. Who cares? Fucking. Hey, Marcus. Um, oh, thank you for the biddies, Marcus. Uh, feeling slight nostalgic from New Year's. And at some point, I have to tell you all the stories I've saved up from the courthouse. I will say one of my favorites was a man charged with causing a catastrophe. It involved multiple totaled cars, a smash through brick wall, and the defendant jumped from a seven story overpass. Happy New Year's and good night, all. Marcus, good night. That That is a hell of a story, too, Marcus. Um, yeah, let's just reconvene. If you're going to hang out, hang out. If you're going to, if you want, let's go over to voice chat. I'm tired of fucking having lights in my face. Oh, for fuck's sake, that feels good. Um, <clears throat> um, so, I'm tired of having lights in my face, and I don't feel like performing for fucking chuds and doing shit like that tonight. So, let's just move over to VC and go from there. So, if you're going to hang out, hang out. I'll stream. Um, Karina and I are probably going to get at least a, a few minutes of dying light in, so you can watch if you want. We'll, we'll do a little co-op here in a little bit. Um, I'll get a little, uh, I'll stream some dying light as well and we can go from there. So I'm just going to jump over to VC right now. 
Um, and yeah, I'll, I'll see whoever wants to join. Um, either way, I'm not even going to fucking raid you guys out. I'm going to do it. Um, feel free to join us if you want. Otherwise have a happy new year. Um, I'll see you guys on Monday either way and see everyone there or later. Happy new year. I know, right? Um, if you're celebrating, be safe. Otherwise, catch y'all later. Get turned. Peace. Drink the way into the new catastrophe. Later, y'all.